Oh, hey, Giz, how are you, mate? Good, mate. Sorry, mate. I've been having some technical difficulties. Nah, that's all right, mate. I reckon there'd be a fair few people uh, using these sort of apps. So, what's been uh, what's been happening? Um, oh, not a lot to be honest. Just been uh, self isolating. Had plenty of jobs to do around the house. Um, just tidying up a few things on the outside and that. But what about yourself? What have you been up to? <laughs> not much, mate. Your your head's frozen in a uh, nice little look for you there. Yeah. Might take a photo of that. Um, no, nah, I've been doing the same. I've just been from home with the girl. So Emma started working from home for a couple of days so she doesn't have to go into the hospital at the moment, which is great. That's uh, good. Running the mark, just a little two-year-old trying to uh, keep her entertained in the battle. But no, nah, it's been good so far. Not too bad. Yeah, nice one. Nice. What have you been doing to stay in shape, mate? Uh, oh, there's plenty to do. The club's uh, been right onto it in terms of giving us programs and um, that's a follow from home. So um, a lot of the boys have got uh, equipment from the club. So, um, yeah, there's, there's plenty to do. But at this stage, we can still get out and go for a, a run. Uh, so I'm sure we've all been, or a lot of the boys have been on top of that. So what about yourself? So you got a nice setup behind you there. Yeah, no, I've got the, uh, the outdoor gym set up, mate. Bit of... Uh, a bit of muscle beach about it, so I'm all set. So a bit of a bike, a few weights, been for a few runs here and there. So um, very good. Whilst while we can, I've had a kick with a couple of boys. So whilst yeah. we can continue to do that, um, I'll do that. And then when when we can't, that'll be when we start getting a little bit lonely. I'll start throwing the, the ball against that brick wall there and kicking. You want to yeah. make sure it doesn't rain. There's no roof in your backyard. Oh, I've got the veranda here, so I'll uh, I might have to pull it under here and chuck it on the deck. But no, I'll put it away if there's any rain. Rain yeah. coming, the club's not going to be too happy with a rusted barbell. Ah, <laughs> uh, no, nah, but it's been okay so far, mate. Just uh, yeah, just been doing a little bit of that and catching yeah. up on a little bit of TV. I'm, I've got a uni assignment due in a couple of days, so I've got to smack into that and get that done. You been watching any TV shows? I watched. Uh, the Lion King, is that what it's called? Tiger King, the Tiger oh, King. Tiger King, yeah. Got a couple more episodes of that to go, and that's an interesting uh, bunch of people in that show, so I'm not sure how that'll turn out, but um, I've so far stuck to it. I'm not sure if I can I'm, – I'm glad there's only a couple of episodes to go because it's, it's not great, but uh, they tell me that everyone's watching it, so what about yourself? Yeah, I got sucked in by that, that show. Um, I, I didn't mind it at all, actually. Very interesting characters on there, so – yeah. Um, it was something definitely uh, a lot different. So, yeah, I got sucked in by it. I think I finished it in one sitting or one day. So, <laughs> What else have you been doing? Um, well, uh, a lot of stuff in terms of uh, the backyard. And we've, we've been sort of over the past two years trying to renovate this, this house we've uh, bought. But it's been, you know, in the footy season a lot quieter, but off season and, and certainly now while I've got plenty of time, I'm just trying to uh, finish off a few things. So it's been a bit of a project that uh, Emily and myself have been attacking, but we're slowly getting there. So, yeah. Any fights so far or you've been pretty civil? Uh, no, nah, we've been pretty good. Um, we know when we're uh, annoying each other that we like to, you know, give each other a bit of space. So I'll let, I'll chuck the headphones in, go in the garage and tinker around with a few things. And Em's still working at this stage and she does work from home. So she's been pretty busy with that. So Yeah, oh, that's all right. It's good that she can work from home. Yeah. What about Emma? Is she back at home working or is she still? Yeah. Yeah, no, she's she's working at home now, which is good. So um, she obviously works at the hospital normally. So yeah. Um... Yeah, it's a little bit worrying seeing her roll into the hospital every day, but she's lucky enough to have a job where she yeah. work from home now. So she started working from home. So we just set up a little office in the spare room for her to work from home, which can be challenging when you've got a little girl that loves her mum. So yeah, so far, so we've just done the usual. I will say she's going to work and leaving for work in the morning, and she's going to shut the bedroom door and hide in there for the whole day. So yeah, when Harry goes and has a yeah. Uh, couple hour nap i'll sneak a coffee and some lunch in there and then shut the door yeah. again and away we go so uh no nah, it's it's good to have a home to be honest you'd, you'd rather be here than um than be out, out yeah. and it's, it's important to stay home obviously so um yeah one thing to worry about really for sure how's lily going she'd be loving everyone being home 
I don't know where Lily must be inside. Um, yeah, mate, she's uh, she's an anxious dog at the best of times, and so when uh, whenever we're out and about, she tends to destroy things. So the one thing, uh, the one thing I haven't had to do in the last couple of weeks is destroy anything, uh, fix anything that she's destroyed. So huh. I might, might have to hide from her for a few hours one day soon so she can destroy something. So I have got something to do. <laughs> it's a bit like that. You're sort of twiddling your thumbs trying to find stuff to do. Yeah, no, it's uh, yeah, it's funny. Like when you've got a little child, you just kept, you just kind of keep them entertained the whole time. But um, yeah, this can be a battle. The, the quietest I am is the two hours she takes during the day. What about um? I saw you sent me a video the other day. You and Em doing some ball work together in the uh, out in the backyard, having a kick and playing the ball to each other. Yeah, uh, it was more just a bit of a laugh. Just get get a uh, get a bit of reaction from a few boys, but. Yeah, got her out in the backyard, throwing some balls into the hands. Um, then we did a did a workout. It's actually been good because she's uh, been down in the garage in the gym with me and doing a few workouts. So um, she's been enjoying that. A lot more breaks though. <laughs> are you um are you been managing to stay you know uh, in touch with your teammates? You've been having a few virtual coffees or? Um. Yeah, I went away uh, with Jimmy and we've, we've FaceTimed a few times uh, since then and um, he's had plenty to do as well in his backyard. Um, Lones is struggling big time, my little mate. He, uh, he's, he loves his golf and I um, sent a message to a WhatsApp group before saying there was a rumour going around that he was uh, banging down the door at the Woodlands Golf Club trying to get on for a hit of golf. Um but yeah, he's he's uh, trying to keep himself busy. He's got a little pup, so he's um, I guess she'll be the best uh, trained dog in Australia after this is all done. Spending a lot of time with her. Um, yeah, so no, there's plenty of boys that are keeping busy. We've got a lot of WhatsApp groups and uh, a lot of banter back and forth and keeping everyone I guess engaged, which is important in this time. So yeah, no, very much so. That's it. The WhatsApp's been going mad to the roof. I mean, not many different uh, different WhatsApp groups at the moment, but it's uh, a good way to tick through the day, isn't it? I, um, a lot of our boys have headed home, actually. Haven't a lot of the boys have headed back to their farms? And, yeah. You know, there, yeah. So we had a touch base with them in a few days. This is something that um, we're going to do regularly. I think I'm going to take have a few phone calls, record them, and then post them on uh, online. So, yeah. yeah. I think there's a few boys back on the farm like Ben Patton and uh, Rowan Marshall back in Portland. So I'm about to see what they're up to if they're milking cows or the herd. King of Portland. Yeah, the, the Prince of Portland's gone back. So you big news back there. <laughs> uh, it's very good. So did you um you're normally used to uh doing some self isolation on your own when you head up bush and get away from everyone. Did you manage to try and sneak that in when you when we first finished up? Oh uh, yeah. Initially, straight away, um, when we did have a bit of time just to relax, I thought it would be a good idea to try and sneak away for a few nights and, I guess, prepare for self-isolation. Um, but I went up there with Jimmy for a few nights and we just kicked back and sat around the fire and just chatted about everything and anything and just tried to keep our minds ticking over. But, um, yeah, it was good to just relax and get away for a few nights. Um, but, yeah, now being back here and um, self-isolating. Uh, it can be it can be hard at times, but you just got to keep, I guess, in contact with uh, everyone and, and um, check in with blokes. How long do you reckon it will take before you run out of things to do around the house? Have you had, had enough to the bunnings or? Well, that's, yeah, that's what I, I don't want to just get it all done in, in one day, one or two days, because then I will be really struggling. Um, so I'm just trying to, Little things uh, at a time, but yeah, we've got plenty to do, so I should be right to stay uh, on top of things. Yeah, nice. And um, what else? What else? Are you gonna you gonna read a book or learn the guitar or what are you gonna do over this next little period? Because uh, you're, you're into your landscape too. What are you gonna do with that? Yeah, well, our course is obviously being suspended for the moment, so can't uh, can't go on with that. But um, I will try and read up on a few few books. Uh, landscaping books would be nice and renovation um, books and that sort of thing. But, um, yeah, other than that, I'll, I'll find something to do in the garage. Um, clean. It's given, my garage has never looked any cleaner, so I'm pretty happy about that. Oh, it's good because last time I was in there, I picked up a cricket button and had a red back on my hand. 
Yeah, you've been carrying on that about that for a while. But uh, no, he wasn't going to hurt too much. I let him let him live in his corner on the cricket bat until you came along. Um, but yeah, what about you? you I'll say you bought a guitar. Yeah, I bought, I bought a guitar. Day I've learnt three chords. I've actually never ever played it, so I learnt and I learnt three chords in about I don't know a couple of hours, and then I was um having a little jam to myself, just flicking between the three the three chords, thinking I was Jimi Hendrix, and Harriet came over and pulled the string and she snapped it. So I've um had a snap string for the last five or six days. So I haven't been able to get in there and have a jam. So I uh, watered another <laughs> jam. Watered another string. So hopefully it'll get delivered in the uh, in the next few days and uh, I can start whacking back on it. But I, um, yeah, when that comes, I'll start getting back into it. I'm not sure how good I'm going to go, but we'll see. Yeah. Yeah. No, nah, it's all good. Well, anyway, mate, I've got to go. I've actually got to be on. So, um, yeah, flat out. Yeah, I'm flat out. So I um I better go because there's uh there's plenty for me to do. So I'll um I better go. You look after yourself. Make sure you stay stay at home and self self isolate. And I uh, might yeah. check it another time. I'll um I'll jump back on the couch. I just flicked on uh, Fox Footy actually, and Plugger just kicked his six in a uh, first final against Geelong. I think it was on. So oh, that, was, um, that was pretty interesting. He'd, uh, oh, we'll maybe get some goal kicking tips off him. Yeah, I might actually. He didn't miss too many, did he? Nah. So uh, when you come back, you can. Uh, the same fans will be happy to know that you're not going to miss any. <laughs> no dramas. All right, mate. Well, I'll um, uh, speak to you soon. Too easy, mate. Catch up. Yeah, mate.